Welcome to the Abiding Podcast. We are a community of the faithful committed to supporting one another to abide in Christ daily. We invite you to learn more about us at abideinfaith.com. Peace be with you and welcome to day eight of our novena. St. John Paul II once said, Yours is the gigantic task of overcoming all evil with good, always trying amidst the problems of life to place your trust in God, knowing that His grace supplies strength to human weakness. You must oppose every form of hatred with the invincible power of Christ's love. Let us pray today for those in our world who are deprived of religious freedom and those who suffer persecution, torture, and death because of their faith. And here are our prayers for today. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Merciful God, I pray with thanks and gratitude for the great spiritual gift of St. John Paul II's apostolic life and mission. Through his heavenly intercessions, please grant the following petitions. Grant also that I may grow in love for you and proclaim boldly the love of Jesus Christ to all people. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. O Blessed Trinity, we thank you for having graced the Church with St. John Paul II and for allowing the tenderness of your fatherly care, the glory of the cross of Christ, and the splendor of the Spirit of love to shine through him. Trusting fully in your infinite mercy and in the maternal intercessions of Mary, He has given us a living image of Jesus the Good Shepherd. He has shown us that holiness is the necessary measure of ordinary Christian life and is the way of achieving eternal communion with you. Grant us by his intercession according to your will the graces we implore through Christ our Lord. Amen. St. John Paul II, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you so much for praying with us today. If you would like to share your prayer intentions, please go to abideinfaith.com and look for the JP2 Novena under the Pray With Us tab. Also, we invite you to share this Novena with your friends and family. God bless you.